Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stephanie. If you're new here, I am a reseller. I primarily sell on Poshmark as well as a few other platforms. Um, so I have a very huge haul. <laughs> I've been collecting things and just collecting and collecting and I haven't been listing so I just thought I would show you everything that I have purchased over the past few weeks couple weeks I'm not even sure how long but I am nine months pregnant I have two weeks left until this little guy comes out so I want to this will most likely be my last haul until who knows when <laughs> so yeah I just wanted to see I just wanted to make one last video before you know things get a little hectic for me and yeah, um, everything I got was basically from Goodwill. There is one bag that I got from a thrift store near my house that is like a church thrift store. So oh, I'm already out of breath. So please excuse the huffing and puffing. So yeah, all right, let's just get started. Alright, this first item is this uh, romper, sheer looking romper thing. Brand is BCBG. Uh, yeah, I paid $5 for it. But I was going to send this into thread up. So, I'm not sure. Alright, this next piece is a, like a shift dress with grid pattern kind of thing on it. It is new with tags and the brand is BB Dakota. It is a size medium. Well, new with partial tags, I should say. <laughs> All right, this next item is a beautiful wrap dress, which I'm still trying to find like a um, stock photo for. Because I don't have a dress form and as you can just see here it, with it on the hanger it looks horrible but it's Calvin Klein and it's a size 10 but it's just it's so beautiful all right this is a new tag DKNY peplum blouse so yep that's pretty much it <laughs> Oh, I, the size is P. Oh, and it is silk. All right, we have a new tags Lulu's dress, size small, but I just thought this print was absolutely gorgeous. It's giving me like cottage core vibes for sure. Uh, buttons here in the front, deep V, and it zips in the back. next item is another silk piece. This is a dress. It has the tie sleeves here or the straps. Um, it is made well. Extra, extra small. But I think it could fit up to a small. Alright, next we have a Prana asymmetrical uh, top. Um, haven't had a chance to look this one up yet. It's an extra small, but the material tag has been ripped out, so I'm not sure if this is like a linen blend or a wool blend. I'm not sure. I found this point sir extra small ribbed long sleeve top, and it ties on the side. This is a first time find for me and it's a new brand. It's Conversations by Anthropology. But look at this print, it is so cute. Um, it has like the different instruments. So, and this is a size four. Uh, it says a limited edition 
capsule collection featuring original prints that speak to the heart and art of anthropology. So that's kind of neat. Um, little fun fact, I was in orchestra um, in my high school years. I played flute for eight years. <laughs> I haven't played it since, but. So this, I just could not pass up. It is a very unique boho piece. It is genuine leather with some like crochet detail. I just cannot leave this behind. It is a pretty hefty piece. Um, I've never heard of this brand. Gantos. It's 80% leather and the trim is rayon. 20% rayon. Um, I did pay $7 for it, but I don't know. It's just, just like a unique one-of-a-kind piece. So I wanted to try it. All right, next we have a chunky sweater, which I love, I love sweaters. This is like a purple with some mixed in whites. The brand is Free People. I think it's an extra small, yeah. Wool blend. I normally don't pick this brand up, but it was just too cute. It's a uh, BKE right? Gimmicks by BKE, which is sold at the Buckle, I believe. But I thought this cardigan was super cute and it's a size medium. It has all that fun detail. <sighs> How is this so <laughs> exhausting? Like, oh my goodness. All right, I found this kimchi blue, which is Urban Outfitters. Just this cardigan and it has like a metallic thread throughout. I picked this up because I've sold this sweater I think four other times and it always sells quick. Um, it is Izod Lacoste which they don't collaborate anymore as far as I know. Uh, this is a size small and yeah, I don't normally see a material tag with it, but it does feel like a wool blend. It has the alligator there. Um, I believe this may be vintage, but I these always sell. And the ones that I've sold in the past, they have been like stained and I've gotten 25 to 30 each for them. So very excited to find that. Our next item is this athleta dress. It has this really cool neckline and um, it's a size large and it has a pocket right here. Okay, I found some lemon pants. I'm not sure of these, what the style is called, but it kind of has like um, track jacket material on the bottom here. But excellent condition. Size 10. Yeah, it still has the rip tag. So I need to still look these ones up. These I got for myself. They're for postpartum. They were only three bucks. They're Adidas, but they're like an extra large boys. <laughs> All right, and then I found these Flag and Look linen pants. The brand is Cut Loose, size medium. So hopefully these do okay. I found this really cute, um, very fall colored uh, skirt. The brand is 
Mark by Marc Jacobs. It's a size medium. So hopefully this does okay. Probably won't get like a ton for it, but I do have a couple purses. I've never found, I found this brand before, but I didn't know they made purses. Um, it's in excellent condition. It's this beautiful yellow leather purse. Inside is like flawless and the brand is Bowden. So I think I'm just gonna sell this myself and not send it to thread up so I don't know because I was debating on sending it to thread up all right, all right my next two purses this is a crocodile leather bag I don't know it's crocodile leather I don't know <laughs> Uh, but I thought it was just super unique and I just thought somebody would like it. So it's a brand I've never heard of. The inside looks great. It is genuine leather. So yeah, it is leather, but I was looking at other people's listings and it does say that it's like a crocodile. Uh, Bors and Pell, made in Italy. I don't know if you'll be able to see that or not, but it's again just a very unique purse. And my last one, if it doesn't sell, I'll just keep for myself. I just thought it was very, very cute, small. It's like the perfect, uh, shopping shopping purse <laughs> uh it's leather very clean i've never heard of this brand either but it is also made in italy and i don't know just thought it was very adorable goes with everything and then my last purse i found this new with tags brown Purse. I don't think it's real leather just because of the brand that it is. Um, the limited. Uh, it was only three dollars, so I and it was new with tags. I thought I'd, I'd try it. So I don't think it's real leather, so I'd be. I would be surprised if it, if it was real leather, but it's still a pretty nice fall-like, sorry, a uh, fall-like purse. So my, um, one of my local Goodwills was having a 75% off tag, color tag sale. So a lot of these items I picked up specifically to sell, to, to sell, no send into thread up. So this first piece is a BCBG Max Osria um, top. So I'll be sending this to thread up. I have a box of thread up stuff over there. I found this loft sweater. I thought the color was very pretty. I don't know if I will send this to thread up or sell myself, but I mainly got it for thread up, so I'll just send it there. I did find quite a few plus size pieces, and they're cute plus size pieces. So I found this um, sweater, different. Oh. I am so tired. <sighs> I found this sweater. It has like the leopard print, cheetah print, whatever 
and this turtleneck. Super soft, almost famous, but it's a 1X. So we'll see how this does. I think I'll list this myself because I don't have a whole lot of plus size pieces. <coughs> I got these for myself. These are White House Black Market. They're the jogger, but these would be perfect for, you know, after pregnancy. I don't know what to put these things. Okay, I found this Simply Emma. I've never heard of this brand, but it's a plus size piece and I thought it was very cute. Um, what was it? Yeah, 2X. So I'm really hoping somebody will bundle items and I would send them a nice offer. All right. Sending, sending this to thread up. It is new with tags. It's BCBG. Fun little top here. <laughs> so this is going to thread up. Ooh, and I was really excited when I found this because it was 75% off. It's Speechless, which is sold at Nordstrom Rack, I believe. <coughs> but it's this absolutely cute, and I don't even know if I'll be able to show you at all, uh, but it's a jumper or jumpsuit with this polka dot print and it ties here in the front so you can have like a little bow tie but it's also a size large and it zips in the back and the elastic waist so I'm really excited about this <sighs> all right and then I found a Christmas sweater to sell I've never tried selling Christmas sweaters but it says let's get mutts and it's just from Target size medium Excellent condition. I thought the, the sign was quite funny too, so. <sighs> All right, here's the other BC BG top that I found that I'm sending to thread up. They're both new with tags. Oh, I found this for myself, just a basic Madewell. Uh, top um, to do projects in <sighs> better than ruining my nicer clothes and I found three of those I found one in that color one in black one in blue so it might actually come in handy for when I'm postpartum as well. This is the first time I picked up this brand, mainly because it was cheap and in pretty good condition. It's a sweater, it's very nice. Eddie Bauer, size small. So we'll see how that does. <clears throat> I found this. American Eagle top. That is just so cute. It has like the some dots here. Whatever this is, you know, the words. So very cute. I loved the color. Then I found this really cute embroidered top here it is tiny which is anthropology but look at the detailing of this it's so pretty size small i think yeah so i did pay full price for this so that wasn't part of the sale um, i found this sweater 
which I thought was just in excellent condition and it was 75% off so it's kind of hard to say no I don't know anything about this brand uh, field gear since 1980 made in Hong Kong size small 100% cotton so I gotta do more research on that I found Jean and Delancey and it's a 1x why I picked it up but it's this off the shoulder top super cute And then I found this Style & Co. Extra Extra Large, which I believe is sold at Kohl's. So, but look at how cool this is, like patchwork tie front top. It's a, yeah, Extra Extra Large. So, not sure where I'm gonna list this one yet. I found Nanette, Nanette Lepore. This is like a very unique piece. It has birds and flowers and a ribbon side tie. Some ruched detailing. This is a large. So I was planning on sending that to thread up, but I want to do more research on that specific top. Found this linen top by CNC California, size medium. I don't think this has been worn, so sending this to thread up. I'm also sending this to thread up. It is loft, 100% linen, I think, yeah. But it's this floral, floral top, size medium, large. So I'll be sending that to thread up. Not expecting a huge profit, but I also didn't pay a lot for it, so. Uh, I'll be sending this to thread up as well. Another BCBG piece. What's this? Kind of top. <laughs> so that's going to thread up. never heard of this brand. Jason Maxwell, it's a 3X, that's why I got it, but I do need to wash this stain treated or something. But it's just a plain gray sweater with a little pocket in the front. I'm gonna send this to throw up. Oh baby. This is White House Black Market. It's just like a one shoulder dress with the thing up there. Found this really cute tank. Brand is Maurice's which I don't think is anything special, size two, but it was cheap, so, and I don't have a lot of plus size pieces, so. I found this brand here. This is a very cute striped top. What is it, a 3X? So I'll list that. Ugh. That's another cute blouse. This is just, it's very nice. Love the color. I'm not sure where this brand is sold, but it is a 2X. So it's very nice sleeves. Hopefully that does good. All right, this I'm sending into thread up. I want to try this brand, um, but it's this blouse with sheer 
sleeves. So, and a bedazzled little or embellished front there. <laughs> um, this I might send to Thread Up Charter Club Extra Extra Large, but it's this fun print top. I like this brand, it is Mason Scotch, or Scotch and Soda, um, but it's part of their Nomadic Dreamers line. It's just a fun little top, size 2, I don't remember what that size is, if it's like a medium, I think it might be a large. Sending this to Thread Up, it's just Lucky Brand. If you know me, I hate Lucky Brand. So I, I just wanted to try it to Thread Up. I'm sending this to Thread Up as well. It's Talbot's. Excellent condition. Has like that really cool hem. This is purple. Sweater, it's a size medium. Old Navy, extra, extra large, cute floral tank. I will sell this. I will sell this myself. <laughs> Can't talk. I'm just so tired. <sighs> and they drew some blood from me today, so. Um, I'm a little tired. I found this gorgeous Torrid top. I like selling toward, so it's just a pink mauve color. I'm gonna send this to thread up. I won't make a lot from it, but it's just J. Crew Factory, but it is a wool blend sweater. Super soft. And I found this pink Green Bay Packers cardigan, which I meant to see if my grandma wanted this, but it is a size medium, but it has like a sequined Packers logo in the back. I forgot to ask her if she wanted that. Oops. So that's everything from the 75% off day. Now, I will show you the things I just got from my regular day. I'll start with some shoes. I found these really cute Dr. Scholl's pointed toe, like corduroy pointed toe shoe. So I thought that was pretty cute. They're in great condition. And then I found these Steve Madden perforated shoe. These are a seven and a half, and I think these are a nine. Pretty sure they were a nine, if I remember correctly. Yes. I don't find shoes that often. All right. This, I actually have these items listed already. This is Athleta, I believe this is called the Shadow Chi Stripe Top. It was very, very hard to photograph. It is so bright. Then I found this really cute loft pencil skirt. Size is six. And I found this J. Crew striped um, turtleneck. 
All right, this I picked up just because it's fun and it's silk, silk house, size large. It's almost like a cropped length, but how fun is this? It's giving me like Bruno Mars vibes. <laughs> so I just wanted to try it. Why not, right? I found Victoria's Secret purple workout tank top, size medium. Yeah. Then I found ooh, another J. Crew sweater, extra large. It's a green polka dot. It's very nice. I found J. Jill. Let's see. 100% linen top. It's an extra large. I'm going through these a little faster just because I have these listed in my closet already. Found Vince, size two. Beautiful. I'll insert the stock photo for this uh, cream colored blouse. And then I found a cord dress, you know, kind of like a fit and flare skater style with the polka dots. Hey, yeah. Found this 3X every cheetah print, um, but it is new with tags. It's just sold at Kohl's, but the main reason I got it was because it was a plus size. I got this fun top. It is torrid. Size four is Harper. I'm not sure what that means. And then I found another one, but with stripes. And this one is a size five. I think they call those the Gorget. Gorget blouse. I found this really cute, never heard of this brand, Ava James top. It's new with tags. It might be just some like boutique brand, but I just thought it was really pretty. It's a 3X. And then I found another new with tag Plus size item, Mod Lucive. It's a 3X. It's a cute little top. And it has like open sleeve, hole, keyhole sleeve. And this is the first time I found this brand. It is Carl Lagerfeld, size large but it has like a sheer hem. It's very textured. If this doesn't sell, I'm gonna send it into ThreadUp, but it is Mac Studio 100% silk, size small, pink top. A top that I might end up keeping but I do have it listed. A Rachel Ray, Rachel Ray, oh my gosh. Rachel Zoe, 100% linen tie front top. Very cute. Oh. And then I found this American Eagle Hawaiian shirt crop tie front top, <laughs> size medium. Then I found this new with tag Lane Bryant swing black tank. Size is 26-28. I found this gorgeous kimchi blue romper. It kind of looks like a faux wrap 
dress, but it's a romper, size small. And then, found this. Another Lane Bryant piece. It's this really cute skirt and it ties. And this is a size 20. So these items are, I have listed already. I forgot to show you these shoes, which I still need to clean up. But these are Vince. They are these really cute color black heels. Um, little bit of damage here on the front, but otherwise they're in pretty good condition. These are a size eight and a half. Just a few more items left from <laughs> Goodwill stuff, and then I got a bunch of other things to show you. So this is the first time I found this brand. It is Good American. So I'm excited to try this. And this is new without tags because it still has the thing on there. So very excited about that. And I found three Good American uh, pieces. So this is another bodysuit. And once again, I don't, it's new without tags. And then the last one is this white shirt. So I don't know how much I'll get for them, but so nice to add a brand that's on your below list found this patagonia um organic cotton top i loved the color it's like a a rusty red this top i might end up taking back but it is a silk um, sequined top. Not sure. It's 100% silk, size large. Lawrence Kazar. It looks vintage to me. But I also don't know a whole lot about vintage items. So I think I'll most likely end up selling it. But. All right, my last two pieces from the Goodwill. I found these J. Crew high rise skinny jeans, size 26P. They're the high rise toothpick. And then, it's the first time I've ever found Hudson near me. And I liked them because they had a roll cuff. These are also a size 26. They are the guinea crop cuff. Wait, guinea crop straight with cuff. So guinea, ginny, I'm not sure which one it is, but we should probably get like 25 to 30. All right. If you're still with me, I'm very, very surprised. Cause this is quite the haul. All right, so my local uh, church thrift store, which is like right down the road from me, they are they were having a dollar on all their clothing and 50% off of everything else. So all these items that I found, I'm sending to throw. Found this Lane Bryant, um, like emerald green top going to thread up. Uh, L.L. Bean, size large. It's this polka dot button down. Dahlia, this beautiful uh, 
small blouse, size large. This I'm gonna keep for myself for after pregnancy, actually. It's ASOS. It's just this ribbed top. I meant to put this back, but whatever. It's Chico's. So I don't know how well that will do. I gotta sort of shave the back of this, but I don't know where this is sold. I thought it was very nice. My favorite part was the sleeves, the bell sleeves. I haven't decided if I'm gonna sell this myself or just send a thread up, but it is a very nice um, top by the loft. After looking at this a little more, I believe this is a men's men's shirt, uh, but it is Michael Michael Kors. So I think I might end up selling this myself. It's a size large, so I think I'll sell that because Startup doesn't accept men's items. Bought this because I thought it was cute. CJ Banks, I don't know where that sold, but it's a polka dot cardigan 5X. This H&M top, so cute. Stripe, I think it's a, I don't know, I don't know what your US size it is. Looks like a medium. Found this Gap linen button down. Beautiful green color. Found this Liz Claiborne linen uh, top here. It's excellent condition. Chico pink. I don't know if that's considered a jacket or what. And then, ah, oh, last but not least, it's nothing special, but I'm finally done showing you everything. It's just American Eagle skinny jeans. Um, they are a size 28. 32. So I'll send these to throw it up just to see how it does. So, whew, that was quite the haul. And thank you so much if you have stuck around for that long. I, uh, I am very tired. I think it's just because they drew my blood today. But, well, it could also be that I'm nine months pregnant, so Whew. I hope you enjoyed this video and that it entertained you in some way. I'm sorry I'm so like luggish and out of it a little bit and so out of breath. <laughs> but let me know down below which item was your favorite piece from this haul. I think my favorite piece is definitely the the Lulu's dress that I found, um, new tags, and then the polka dot jumpsuit. I just think that is so adorable. I love jumpsuits and I love the color green and I love polka dots. So it wins everything in my book. Um, but yes, I will hopefully have these things listed soon, but a lot of these items are also going to thread up. Which I know is crazy to send things into thread up, but considering their whole little thing that they did recently. But I still paid a low price for all of these items, so it might be worth it to still send things into thread up. So we'll see. I'll find out if it's worth it. Um, ooh, was my hair sticking up that entire time? Oh well. But. 
we'll see. Um, but that is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed and yeah, hopefully the next time I make a video, I'll have a baby with me. All right, I'm going to end this video now because I've rambled on for too long and it's almost an hour long. Okay. Uh, well, thank you for watching and like always, I'll see you on my next video. Bye.